Welcome to Keeper Training. In this video, we'll demonstrate how to use Keeper on your iOS device. Upon logging in, tap the plus icon from the top right of your screen. Now enter the record title, login, and password information. To strengthen your password, tap the dice icon. With the dice generated password selected, you'll be able to adjust the number of characters in your password as well as toggle on and off the type of characters generated. Please note, your dice generated password does not automatically update your pre-existing account associated with your record. Please log into the website and visit the settings page to update your password to the newly generated one with the Keeperfill extension. Now fill in the URL for the website. This will allow Keeper to recognize the site you're visiting and autofill your credentials with Keeper Fill. As an option, you can add custom fields. With Keeper Custom Fields, you aren't limited to storing just logins and passwords in your Keeper Vault. Answers to security questions, alarm codes, bike lock combinations, credit card numbers, medical records, passports or driver license numbers, and any other sensitive information can be stored in your Keeper Vault. Now tap the Add Files and Photos button to add related items to your record. Photos and videos taken within the Keeper application will not show up in your camera roll. Finally, tap the folder icon to choose from a list of folders to store your new and secure record or you can simply create a new folder by typing a new folder name. Once you've filled all the necessary fields, tap save. If you'd like to share your record with someone, simply tap the share icon and enter the recipient's email here. Underneath the entered email address, you'll be able to adjust the user's permissions. Right here, determine whether or not the user should be able to edit, share, or become the new owner of your record. Please note, make sure the email address entered to share a record is correct to avoid misuse of your shared information. Records can only be shared with and viewed by Keeper Unlimited paid users. Once you share a record, the recipient's email will be listed as pending share. You'll be able to delete an email from this list at any time. If you'd like to share a folder containing a list of records, tap the menu icon above then select shared. In the upper right, tap the plus share folder icon. Name your folder, then enter the user's email address under Users. Finally, tap over the Records button and select the records that will be added to your newly named shared folder. Tap Save and you're all set. Now let's activate and use the Keeper Fill extension. With Keeper Fill, you can autofill your login credentials across your favorite mobile apps and browsers for fast and secure access. In order to activate Keeper Fill, open Safari and tap the Share icon, then tap More. Toggle on Keeper Fill, then click Done. When you access the login section of the site, tap the Share icon in Safari and click the Keeper icon, which will launch Keeper Fill. Here, you're going to have to either log in with your master password or fingerprint. Determine and choose the correct login info to use and tap the fill button. As you can see, your login information was automatically entered. You can also use Keeper Fill going through the Keeper application. Here's how. Choose the record you would like to use Keeper Fill. Tap the URL link to open an in-app browser with Keeper. Within the login page, you'll notice that your login credentials are ready to be used with a simple tap to autofill each field. Now log in. Thanks for watching this video. For more information, visit keepersecurity.com/support.